you can't think on an empty stomach, and you're going to need your wits about you for an epic battle of minds. <laughs> I think I can outsmart Darren. Yes, but today you'll be sparring with a far greater intellectual opponent. Sparring with who? With whom? Oh, James. You do know this looks like stalking. Uh, it's not stalking if it's meant to be. Right. I'll remember that when I'm defending you in court. Kyle? Is Kyle here? Well, make yourself a home. Well, how is he? James has given up on him. James is struggling to magic a killer out of thin air. Right. Fine. I'll do it. Ooh, lucky me. I feel honoured. I want to sue Grace. Huh. Who doesn't? Well, it's that shoddy loss. You told me you had a plan. I could have come up with a better plan than what you did. Somehow I struggled to believe that. I thought we had something. Well, that stuff with your dad really opened up. I should throw you out just for using the term opened up. Anything else? Hmm? No, no, run along. Now, if you don't mind. Has something happened? Yes, you barged in and ruined my morning. Oh, actually, no, what I really want is for us to all go on a night out. A double day, seriously. Mm -hmm. Or we could all walk on broken glass. Busy morning. So, so, <clears throat> I fancy sushi. Obs. Please. <laughs> no. 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 And once again, a definite no. Go on, get out, all of you. <laughs> I didn't invite any of you in in the first place. Go on. <laughs> chomp, chomp. Grumpy pants. Off with you. Yeah, well, my true feelings that you're a liar that got me grounded. Doubly, sorry. <laughs> One of your associates owns this little place, then. Do one. <laughs> temper, temper. Oh, Juliet, darling, if there's one thing I have learnt in my four decades on this earth... Five. I'm counting. Harry made his choice. He chose prison. <clears throat> and people who end up in prison are, in my estimation, life's losers. Why do you think you can just do whatever you want? Call him a mum a junk-up prostitute. <laughs> Perhaps I should have been more creative. Do you know what, Cindy? You're not as dumb as people say you are. Thanks. Oi! Can't stop thinking about Ryan. Hmm? Try harder. Hey, hang on. What are you doing with that? Oh. It was a gift from Sid. Very sweet, but uh, I wouldn't touch such bargain bin trash. Should have saved his £4.50. Well, it was a fiver, actually. Is he all right? He will be. When you confess to the crime. <laughs> That's a joke, right? Yeah, I thought that might be your initial reaction, given the wonderfully maternal creature you are. Oh, it's like sitting on a cloud. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Kyle. Hello, James. But hang on, you didn't... Offer to walk a 17-year-old into an early grave in the vague hope of getting Juliet off the hook? How heartless do you think I am? How long have you got? You're like, don't clip your toenails in bed. Don't leave wet towels on the floor. Don't uh, talk during the match. It's the first time that sentence has ever come out of your mouth, isn't it? <laughs> oh, James, don't be such a snob. Says the woman who once sent back a cheese board because, and I quote, it was too northern. James, what on earth are you doing in here? Trying to be alone. Just a second opinion. You know, in case I've missed anything. Well, you know, hundreds of lawyers, why me? You live the closest. Look, PC Smith is dirty, and I just need you to use your lawyer powers to help me get the proper evidence. Lawyer powers? Mm -hmm. I've been a little uncivilised to you in recent weeks. But as it turns out, you're not completely useless. James, that's the sweetest thing you've ever said to me. What about Damon? Or does it not bother you that he faces going to prison? Maybe prison isn't such a bad thing. Oh, you two really are soulmates, aren't you? Polish away. Doesn't bother me at all. Me neither. Good. Fine. Fine. We need to take Victor down. Yeah, please, come in. Don't put your head down to the station now. I'll be charged with GBH. It'll be ABH, actually. And a push. Now, I can see I'm dealing with a uh, moron, so I'll get straight to the point. <sighs> Look, <laughs> you're worried about the whole Ryan thing. Uh, wear a black man tear. Hmm? Let off a balloon. Write it in your diary. Just uh, don't come crying to me. Right. Wait, 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 wait. Not you. Where do you want me to stay? It's obvious. According to Warren Fox, you confessed to killing your husband. No, I didn't. She means no comment. You... Well, now, 
Isn't this cosy? There really is no getting rid of you, is there? What is that monstrosity? <laughs> it's a gift for Joe. We, um, got together. Oh, so my little scheme worked. Once you overcame that irritating conscience of yours, I think I deserve a little peck. No. So I've been giving some thought to this dog situation. Maybe we can find a compromise. Oh, I like the sound of that. Yeah, Alfie needs someone to look after Barbarella. The lizard. It's four legs and a tail. What more do you want? And this really isn't the best time. Oh, my heart bleeds. That can be arranged. Joe broke up with me. He's getting back together with Mercedes. Surely you must have known this was a possibility. Why would I know that? Because <laughs> they're a perfect match. The last book either of them read must undoubtedly have had lift the flaps. Now you're saying I can't even hold her? Those are the terms of the injunction as it stands. Still, uh, gives you an opportunity to uh, push a broom around. Maybe even hose yourself down. To bed. Turn it off. I can't hear you. Turn it off. Amy didn't even let me see Leah. I don't owe her nothing. Anything. Do him. Well, the crescent in the cherished shop suit who's never kissed a woman. Yes. That is Bernard. He works in IT. He plays badminton recreationally. And he collects belly button fluff. I've been trying to call you. Well, that night that Amy died, the night you were around yours. Oh, yes, the night you broke in. Yeah, well, we'd be running a restaurant again. Don't you have two little baby things? Like I said, I'm really in a hurry. Ooh. Doesn't he know it's meant to be? Never was one for religion. You're born alone, you die alone. Better get used to it. Cheers. I was a wee bit down before, but now I'm really depressed. <laughs> what do you want? Relax, Harry. I burst an artery. Are them your divorce papers? It's off. She's going to burn them to delay proceedings. She still hates Grace for stealing her man. You are so bad for my pub. Oh, I never got my coffee anyway. Juliet! Oh. Oh, charming as ever. My aunt's made an itinerary. I had jolly day out at Mum's funeral. Family. <laughs> Ghastly creatures. <laughs> what did I say? No, I was willing to share my sofa and some leftover pasta with you, but not my life. We're all going to take care of you now, aren't we, James? Who's he? That is James, your favourite son. Now you are a sight for sore eyes. Supposed to be concentrating on the future, remember? And the immediate future is me being very single and you being very cold. How can you be so heartless? Oh, I'm sorry. My bad. <laughs> 